Hey guys, welcome back to my garden. I want to plant some lettuce seeds right now. We got some pirate butterhead, some green tower romaine, and some black headed S Simpson. I mean, black seeded Simpson. So, winter time is a great time to grow lettuce seeds, like I mentioned earlier. It's nice and cold. Your, your lettuce is less likely to bolt, which is the problem that I seem to always have. Always grow in the summertime. Winter time, I never really grew too much, so now is a great time and opportunity for me to experience and grow along with you guys. So, hopefully, this is what I'm going to have in four to six weeks. What's right in front of me looks delicious, right? Looks pretty good. So, I like to use basically this these uh, two and a half ounce um, little cups. Sometimes I cut the slits in the bottom just to use as like a little double cup method, but doesn't make a difference. We're mainly using this just to like sprout it in. So I like to use coco core. I keep it right here at the bottom. Coco core is a great, great grow media, guys. You can see the top of it right here when it dries up. It looks like this light brown. Clear indicator of when it wants water. It definitely lets you know itself. It feels nice and light. Huge difference from when it's wet. It retains a ton of moisture. You see when I squeeze this, there's nothing. But you could clearly see the difference when I dig down here to the bottom you could clearly see the color difference and this here feels a little bit more moist you can see when I squeeze it together it retains its form for the most part but definitely not wet enough so I'm just gonna fill it in now what are we gonna do here three yeah let's just do three now when you're packing in your pots or your cups you want to push it in and give it like a nice firm press make sure it's nice and in there and that's all we have it don't worry about that I like to reuse cups no sense in throwing a bunch of them and reusing them away we got enough plastic going in the garbage as is so we got two more to do sorry about the shaky camera guys you are on my neck right now if you seen that apparatus I'm wearing to record this video you guys would laugh. It's for the tubes. You gotta get those likes. Nah, this is just having, we're just having fun, guys. So, there we go. We're gonna water it in just a minute. Nah, uh, I'm not even gonna water, worry about labeling this right now. Since I already got my hands dirty, and... What am I doing here? There we go. We just need like pretty much like two seeds. Lettuce will come up in like two, maybe three days, something like that. So just dig a little hole. Drop the seeds in. And a little pat, pat, pat. Beautiful. So that's one. We need a two. Try to do it as fast as possible. Love this love the sound of shaking seed the packet. Is it just me or do you guys like that also? Ah, uh, I had four and I got one. Give me one. There we go. Lettuce seeds are super small. So easy to drop. Doesn't really have to go that deep in it at all. Cause all we're doing is just using this basically as like a medium just to get the seed to sprout when it comes up a little bit bigger we're going to transplant it into a hydroponic cracky system like you see in front of you there that's two and one more quick little details should have done the details for the other ones that's all right it's lettuce guys it's green it's tasty And these seeds look a little different, much darker in color. So hopefully that's probably the black seeded Simpson. Tapa tapa. And let's just water these things and we're done.
Now cocoa core will retain a lot of moisture and it's definitely going to stay a lot more moist than opposed to like for example like soil. Rock wool is also not a bad example to use but we're just sprouting this. Once it sprouts I get to reuse the cocoa core, no sense in throwing it away. Since the seeds are just sprouting I'm not adding any chemicals or anything to this. Seeds will come up in two to three days. I'm going to keep this basically in the dark until the seed sprouts, after which I'm going to put it under some grow lights, maybe one to two inches right underneath. We'll go along and do that together. So let's just transplant these. Transplant. Let's move these down below. Put on the heat tray. I already got three, four other ones right behind it. And there we have it. So we're going to be back soon for more. I got some seeds in the back, hopefully that are going to come up any, any day now. And we get, we're going to get some videos going, guys. It's a new season. Let's get back into it. We got tomatoes, we got cucumbers back there, we got some sour gherkins, we got ground cherries. I got a few more seeds that I need to plant right now, so we'll be back soon for more. Let's fill up my grow space. Uh, look, guys, like the episode, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.